This video shows the surgical cleaning of an inflammatory focused in a patient with clinical diagnosis amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, i.e. ALS, and an increasing restriction of the entire motor function. The x-ray shows the root-filled teeth 1.7 and 1.8 in the upper jaw on the right without diagnostic findings. In comparison, at the bottom of the image, the display of the cavitao measurement. The healthy tooth, 1.5, is shown in green and therefore not suspicious. In contrast, the bony areas of teeth, 1.7, 1.8, and also the retromolar area, 1.9, show clear red colouring with suspected fatty degenerative osteonecrosis. Image 3 shows the root-filled tooth 1.8 in the DVT, with no evidence of inflammation. In contrast, the right-hand portion of the image shows the measurement with cavitao in red. This suggests fatty degenerative osteonecrosis in jawbone, FDOJ. The cavitao displays the hard substances of the two roots in white. Between them a clear osteolosis in red. The video starts with the extraction of tooth 1.8. Fatty degeneration between the roots is clearly evident. A sharp spoon scrapes out the fatty degeneration. A fat example is taken with tweezers and submitted for histological examination. Additional fat samples are submitted to the laboratory in tubes for lab analysis of Rant's expression. The lab analysis of the fatty degenerative bone sample examined for Rant's expression shows with 3,750 pgml, a more than 25-fold overexpression of Rant's compared to healthy jawbones. The following 1.8 had a clearly chronic focus of inflammation. The histological assessment, the myxoid degeneration of the fat cells is essential. Myxoid describes the mucus-like degeneration of the bony alveolar process around tooth 1.8 as can be seen in the video. Scientists know that RANT is a marker of immune activation in ALS patients. ALS patients have higher RANT serum levels compared to control groups. Also, RANT's levels in cerebrospinal fluid are higher in ALS patients as compared to healthy control groups. Four volumes of the series, cavity-forming osteolysis, osteonecrosis in the jawbone describe both the scope and the overall importance of the inflammation shown in the video for overall human health.